All right, and welcome back. I'm your man, Bad Chad, and Queen Jolene's on the camera, and Doug's in the house. Jolene hey. wants to film the sheet of metal going on. Jolene wants, which Jolene gets. That's what she wants. That's what we're, we're gonna do. The measurement is 47, or 45 and a half. It's 45 and a half by 57. So we're gonna cut this piece of metal and then we're try to, gonna, gonna try to put it on. I've taken the sander wheel and sanded down some high places on uh, the door itself. These are the places right here where I'm gonna be um, frustrated because the metal is gonna wanna sit on top of that. There's one there, should be buffed off. There's one there, should be buffed off to, or, in order to get that piece of metal to lay nice and on flat on top of that. You know, it is what it is, but I'm gonna have to maybe change where I welded. I'm gonna grind that off. And when we did the video yesterday, um, we heard a bang. Well, the bang was this side over here let go. And uh, I had to reply it back on and put it on from the back side, but it did let go. All right, let's cut the piece of metal. 45 and a half by 57. All right, I'm gonna cut this one. Doug had a a good time yesterday cutting. I'm also do the cutting today. Had a dark bite. I'm huh? jealous. I'm jealous. I'm yeah, very. Don't be jealous, Doug. <laughs> be inspired. I am. I'm inspired to cut everything in two. <laughs> <laughs> Got our length 57, and the width is 45 and a quarter. We'll lay that up one, maybe up one here, Doug. Uh, we might as well cut this rusty side off, or I'm thinking we may as well. Uh, 40 tape measure, doing that thing again. Terrible. Terrible. 45 and a half. I said quarter, but I want to go a half. And the reason being is I'd rather have more than less. I wonder if I shouldn't. Can I hold that in, Douglas? Oh, Douglas. People do not know it. Me and Doug have known or known each other most of our lives, one way or another. We have. We have stories. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to tell any of them. We're not going to tell any no, of them. That's no. Sure. <laughs> now I'm not sure if I want to cut that with a zip cut. If I want to cut it with the with the plasma cutter. What do you want me to cut it with, sweetheart? What would you like me to cut it with? It's your choice. Zip cut. Zip cut it is. Zip it is. Here, Doug, I'm going to give it to you. Okay, thanks. 
Thank you. I'm going to give it to you. Oh, Doug does a good job chance. cutting. Oh, I'm just getting he a bit stays right on the line. She's going to put it right on the zip cut blade. Watch right on the line, in. bud. We, we can cut it on the cut the line if you want to. Yeah, that'd be great. Okay. Do you want a bigger zip cut or that one good? I'll get her all with that, man. The ones last quite well, don't they not? Yeah, they do. I mean, as long as you don't push them and make them disappear, usually they don't. <laughs> you know. I'm going to attack it from the other end, though. I'm going to attack it from the I don't other want to make end. you feel left out, see? I never feel left out around here. You always got something for me to do. <laughs> We put it in the. We haven't got to shoot her that long. Don't get her. I want to talk about mental health. Sometimes my mental health is not at the best. I feel like I have anger issues sometimes which affects my mental health because I do not feel good about myself. Sometimes I feel it would be nice to be able to talk to somebody and let them feelings go. And I have to thank BetterHelp for sponsoring this video because they have 30,000 therapists online at any point in time to talk to you about your mental health. Mental health is not an easy thing to talk about, so I feel it's right for me to talk about it because if I can talk about it, so can you. And we all know sometimes we don't want to talk to family members or friends. And the reason being is being judged. Better help is there for you online at any point in time. You don't have to go anywhere. You don't have to leave your home. You don't have to do nothing. If you do not like the therapist that you're talking to, you can get another one any point in time you want to. If you want to go to betterhelp.com slash badchad, you can get 10% off the first month. And if your mental health is struggling, BetterHelp is there for you. And we all know, sometimes we all need it. You got her down, buddy. Made her, did you? Yeah, got her close. That's all good. I didn't want to stop. Didn't want to stop. That's all right. Just going to hook up the old sandy wheel. And then uh, we'll take off the sharp edges. Right now, I'm over there looking at it, wondering if I should take off the door itself and apply the piece of metal with the door off or keep the door on and try to apply the metal. I just feel like it's going to be a lot of hassle. I don't know how I'm going to get to the top of the door and apply the metal. If you know what I'm trying to say, I have pretty hard to put the metal on top of the door and get to the top of the door and apply it. I'm probably going to have to take the door off and apply the metal and hopefully it goes back on right. Hard to believe that door is that big, but it is. Yeah, for me to get up there and lean over there and try to get the, the, the metal welded to this cage, you see that, do you? I can see if I had a place to stand here and I could get yeah, in there, but I ain't got no sure. place to stand or get into, or I can't, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut it off. Don't know if it's a wrong decision or if it's the right decision, um, but I'm gonna cut the door off and we're gonna skin it that way. That way there we can put the, the C-clamps all the way around the edge. We'll do, well, we'll do whatever. We'll put it up on that end and roll it down and do it. It's just, I like to have it in position. It, I think it's under pressure a little bit, and that's because it didn't fit perfect. That's why it's under pressure. 
They fit tight. They fit tight, man. They fit tight. Kind of got to force them on. So I'm going to cut the door off, and then we're going to try to skin it that way. Will it be a mistake? It's like a trip to the washroom. Will he make it? And Betty won't. <laughs> I got to watch my words. that already that kicked off like that you know I'm trying to you know what I mean yeah with the skin on it it wouldn't kick off like that it would see and it's got a different gap going on now put that back on first mistake I don't like making mistakes but I'm probably the king of it See that come off that way. Back in order. Hmm. Wall it back on. So the, the sheet of metal will keep the shape. Once I put the sheet on tacky, we're gonna keep shape. I just don't know how I'm gonna <laughs> how I'm gonna tack it on and be happy with it. Do you know what I'm trying to tell you? Alright, back to start one. Did not take off, our gap's back. That's better. Cut that off, did I? No, nope. let's lift it up there a little bit. Just gonna walk this down a little bit so the piece of metal can get on there. I want that to stay on there. Why not? Let's see if we can put it on, Douglas. See what happens. Okay. You got a pair of gloves on in case you Okie dokie. No, I don't. Let's have some mercy. Any pair you want to. Uh, the only reason I say that here, I just don't want to see you get caught. I already did. I know, I know. Here's something over there. Now, I don't want that on the cords if possible. Is that the shiny side? They're both shiny, aren't they? They're a bit rusty on both sides. Oh, yeah, it's shiny. Yep. Shiny me. Throw it up on there. Now, I'm going to go to the other side. Man, I'll tell you. So, y'all. She tight, y'all? All right. <laughs> That's what we made it for, Douglas. That's what we made it for, buddy. Now, when... I'm going to give this to you, and you're going to hand that to me on the other side, if possible. We'll turn this bad boy back on. Take a third arm with me. See if I can't get on this side and get up over. reach it I can't reach it well like it's mm, I know you don't want to crawl on top of the damn not really but I'm going to yeah I mean it's, yep it's the only way you can do it alrighty thank you
I can hear the boys horror now. Get off that truck! <laughs> Pull that down some. Douglas, please. Too much? No, keep going. Okay. Right there, B. Absolutely. I just want to pull over just a little tiny bit. Just kick that in over just a little tiny bit. Good. That's good. I, got, I felt it. Excellent. So I didn't. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> didn't feel like it moved at all, did you? Um, I'm scared. Just a little bit more, Doc. Okay. Can you just keep tapping it? I'll feel here. This is back. holding us back over here. Yeah, right, that's we're right up against it, so. Good. Try that. All right. There we go. <laughs> One is holding it. It's holding it now. Now, can you push up on this side? Can you push up? Should we go up? That that piece there is stopping you? It, yeah, I think it is, yes. Can I pop it up yep. over it? Yeah. Okay. Push it up. All right. Now we're sitting on that tag. Pull it back now. a little bit. Push it. Um, You're pretty near sitting right on top of the tab. I understand that. Can you push it up towards me a little bit? Yeah. Right there. That's tight. Huh? That's tight. <laughs> Don't know if that hit or not. I'm not liking where I'm at up here. To be honest with you, up on top of the truck, I'm not liking it, but it is what it is. Um, Douglas. Yes, sir. You're going to have to grab the zip cut yeah. and zip to cut that off. Sure. Flush, if possible. No. If you're able. Uh, I don't know how I would pull the roof out if I, if I dented it in. <laughs> you? Doug? Plunger. <laughs> a plunger. <laughs> Toilet plunger. Nice. I won't even, that thing don't even work when I take it down. <coughs> I know, right? Um, do you want to... Pass me the third. Oh, you cut that off. Cut that off. I'll wait. Are you sure? Yeah, you do your thing. Cut okay. that off. That go, didn't it? Huh? No, I don't think. I think just the piece like go, uh, which was got a little bit of pressure on it. Maybe it did. I can't see it. Did the piece need so you can get down all the way? Didn't It's not down all the way now though, is it? No. Still hooked on there by something. Just give me a second. Still hooked on there yeah, by a little bit. Yeah, you got a little bit. piece of metal there. Yeah, just hold on a second. Yep. Too much. It just moved down on it. Move it out of there. Should come out. Yeah. Get off! Screwdriver? Yep, second buddy. I can get you. That's it. One here somewhere. This'll do. This'll do. Hey, buddy! See that little piece of metal there? Yep. You gotta scrape that I off. See that. Please and thank you. That fits nice up here. You have to hold another up. Yep. Nailed her. You got I her? I think so. Looks a little high. Watch your eyeballs. Looks a little high. Hope that doesn't flop up. I think I got her. I think I didn't nail her. <laughs> you want to come over and give me that um, third arm if you can, Doug? What was that, man? I'm trying to stay out of the center of the sheet metal for third arm. Third arm? Yeah, right there. Oh. Please thank you. I'm just going to go in the center here and pry this down.
missed it. Missed it. Basically, I want all I'm up here for is to try to keep. They're trying to keep. We probably should have had the metal over that way. That's not bad. It's not bad. We probably should have the metal. Hold down that dugout pipe. It's on there. I've got that side on there. I'm going to take give, that, give you that. I'm going to come down. We're going to connect that side. <laughs> Not even sure how we're going to cut it off. <laughs> Break my neck. See, we're off this side. We're on this side. Quite heavy, aren't we? Yeah. We're heavy on this side. We're heavy. That would be heavy on this side. I just got to yeah, knock it off. I got a little tab. We're heavy on this side. We're crooked on this side. We're coming down crooked anyways, but we're just going to... That's too bad. And, and basically, that's me up top nailing it on a little crooked. <laughs> <laughs> nailing it on crooked. I guess that's what I'm getting. Doug, if you want to hold down that for me right there, but I didn't want it over. Don't hold down with this. Okay. I don't want you to push that down. Yeah, I just want, I want to get this. Probably should have said something to you before I nailed it. You okay? <laughs> yep. Yeah. Want to push it down right up here? Okay. I've got a piece of weld. Let's push it down right here. Right, right, right there. Yeah. Got it. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna try to knock off that tab, and the reason being is now this piece of this piece of metal will hold. I don't like it. To be honest with you, we're over quite a ways. I don't like. That, that can be filled full. What? Yeah, too. I don't want to switch, I'm not going to switch it off. What's going on here? You can see when I bring that down, we're off there probably a little better than an eighth, but that's going to have to have weld cover that in all the way. We got a little bit hanging over this side. Um, it is what it is. I'm going to try to take, I've got a little tab. All right, Douglas. We're gonna do the exact same thing. Just bring it down. Can't get in that now because I got too much metal on this side. Damn it! Don't like that. Let's bring this up. You want to hold this side down? I right? just just put pressure on it, like with your hand. That'll give me enough. Watch your eyes. This side is grabbing nicely. Just be careful. Let's go to the other side for a second. Tight, right in there. Go over more. I miles of carbon.
Oh, come over here, Douglas. I'm gonna pluck that on. Let's hold them down tight. Yeah. I can't know. Where do you want it? Can't, can't get in there to weld it, can I? No, she's tight. Put no the wheezy on her. on there now. Let's just work our way down. Let's do this one. Watch right here and just hold right there. Nope, just hold on that. Okay, got, got it? Yeah. It dries. Watch your eyes. You can see where it's held up right there. We gotta get that knocked off. Once we get the door off, then we'll let's go that side. This side's the easy side. <laughs> just push down with your hands maybe Doug instead of that pointer. Yeah. Watch your eyes. Let's do the other side. We're going to be off quite a ways when we come down to the bottom, but let's push it down with you. I think we're almost at a gas, maybe. In that we almost is. I was going to say, you were before, when you yeah, started. Push that down with that. Push your, push your middle down, too. Make yeah. sure to push it off. Yeah. Watch your eyes. Watch your eyes. I'm not sure how you watch your eyes, but that's the same. Watch your eyes. A run out of gas. You can see I'm over there. I don't like that. It makes it, you know, it makes it harder to weld up. It makes it harder to weld up. Trying, very trying. Looks nice though, don't it? We're not. It looks great. Yeah, it looks great. Yeah. A little dent right there. That must be the, where the high spot is. It's high the spot. high spot in our, in our thing. In our right rib there. Right, feel right there. Right there. Feel yeah, it? I can even see it. I can see it. Quite. Plain as day? Yep, very. Very, very. Well, we're hitting right there. I'm not going to hit anything on it now. I guess now what I'm going to try to do is, is cut the door off. And I got... <laughs> uh, I've got things tacked everywhere <laughs> that are hard to get off. Like I got them things tacked underneath that and I got too much metal because I made it too long because I thought we might take it off. But she may have a buckle there somewhere. So. No. Don't talk like that, Doug. <laughs> it could be true, but yeah, it could be true. Snip all your welds off again. Nope. I don't want to do that. All right. Let's get this thing off. I'll just start zip cutting and banging and beating and <laughs> crashing and thrashing. And I'm hoping that this, this piece that we put on here holds that gap. That's what I'm hoping. some of that stuff and see if I can get it off. Oh my. Oh my. 
Can you get that one off that? Get it off? Yep. Something now. This wiggle wiggle. Beat that off. Yeah, kind of a little spot going on there, but that's fine. It is what it is. Hard to believe how much a pack of weld will hold, eh? It's not coming off. These bottom ones off. That tack in the center, too. Urgh. <laughs> <laughs> Urgh. All right. Is what it is. Not very happy, but I eh, suppose that'll go in there, no problem. Screwdriver. Here. It's not really a screwdriver, but it'll work. It'll work. All right. Are we off there? Are we off there? Are we off, man? We're off in the center of that one. I just don't know. Don't I right know? Top. You want to pass it and get up top. Beckles will go the other side. Kind of in a pickle, really. Like it's kind of a. 
not something I'm interested in and messing with. It looked nice and straight going there, but it was just off yeah. a little tiny bit the whole way. Kind of a shame. It is what it is. Pick up now, Doug. Let's go easy on it. Starting to. This side's what? free. What side? This side does. A second, a second, a second, a second. We don't want to hurt it, none. <sighs> Take that bad boy. I'm coming down again. I want to see if I'm putting any dents in the dang thing. No. I want to stand back and take a look at it. Well, there's the hole. Just got to get it cut off. Yeah, it's still hooked over here somewhere. For sure. It's unhooked there. I think it is. Yeah. I think you're hooked right there, man. Right where? Right there. Ha <laughs> ha! Look at that! <laughs> Damn it, Doc! That looks super. Yay! Hey! hooked up there yeah, somewhere. Right there. <laughs> Alrighty. Can we get it off now? No, nope, second. Hooked up there where that pad is. Did it all go crooked on us? Like, did it go well? <laughs> like, it just kind of come over this way. There's like, just something holding it back. One of these tabs. Huh? One of these tabs you have on there, just holding it back. It might have went crooked. Holding it back. Yeah. Too much tabs in there, holding it from going falling right down where it's supposed to. Hey. Yeah, you've got one hooked up up there somewhere. Where's that holding that? And it seems to be so funny, like, you, know, you know what I mean? Like, second now. Can you flop it up this way? Alright, you just hold on to that. Hold okay. it up. Yeah. Because you'll jam you. my fingers Good if you jam. don't. Jam. Keep coming. Keep coming. Okay. Let down. You do have a pair of vice uh, grips in there holding it together, right? Hey, you got a pair of needle nose or uh, vice grips in there holding it together. Is that what's holding that on yeah, there? Yeah, it's just holding it together. <laughs> I can see him helping get it up so high. It is too. I'm just gonna set this down now. It's gonna sit there and <laughs> <laughs> you could have caught those in two with the mini grinder. <laughs> I cut the grinder in half here in a second. Or the Let's see, cut the vice grips right in half. Yang. Damn it. Go. <laughs> fell right in spot, didn't she? <laughs> Alrighty. Just fall right in there, right? I knew it was gonna fall there. I, I knew that was gonna happen as soon as it fell. <laughs> Over to the bench, Doug. Wow. <laughs> you said it. <laughs> yeah. That was a rough one. Let's turn it this way. It's not holding them that much lip up there. Turn it up. Let's get that end over there. Then we'll clamp it all on. We'll go see if we made a mess over here. Did we dent it? No. Nope. I must have put a piece of metal in between there because it didn't hurt a bit. Built like a tank. Yeah. <laughs> Built like a tank. All right, Douglas. We got some some uh, C clamps here. Sure. So Let's awesome. place okay. them on. 
That was a rough one, that was. See? I don't know if we did it, did it all right or if we did it all wrong. But it, was, it was a rough one. Mm. Yeah, basically we're just going to bring it all down and see if we can't get this bottom straight. I'm hoping, well it should have, but... All right, you're going to take a hold of it, are you? I probably should have. That's going to be fine all along there. Just that we got to cut it off, that's all. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on like that without bruising it. It did too, huh? Mm hmm It is. Maybe what if I... Then I just want to hold it down. I'm thinking we're fine there. We'll be able to. No, we're fine there. We can make that work, Douglas. Yeah, good. We can make that work, buddy. Good. We can make that work. All right, let's lay her down. We're gonna cut that off at the end. Uh, I don't know if we can lay it on the ground like we can. I'm gonna get a zip cut. We'll cut that access off, and then we'll pry her down and make her stay. What I'm thinking. Hopefully. Well, boys, I'm thinking Jolene hit the jackpot. She knew what to what to film and what not to film when it come to this door. I thought we'd just skin it and be nothing to it, but bang, just like that, done. Not the case. No, not the case. Had a few issues with it, and it's okay having issues. It's how you overcome it. She knew we were going to have issues. She's just insane. She knew it. She knew it. I'll get you to grab a couple more seed clamps, if you will, Douglas, please, while I get to cut this on. To make things fit is to put it on there and, and cut but in actual fact I didn't couldn't tell the true reading in there and I would not have been able to get anything to weld it anyways well, I just figured if I left it long then I can cut it off and deal with it but it is what can I say it's not the way I would uh, recommend <laughs> We're gonna put this bench or this thing back up on there. 
How about we set it, we'll set it on this little bench and then we'll wheel it over and wheel it back. You want to grab one side there, Douglas? I'll set it on there for... And with me doing it this way and getting it on there a little, this, that side there, this side here will weld up perfectly. We'll get that sanded down weld perfectly. This side here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to have to do more weld. I'm going to have to weld from this edge over to grind that off to make it look nice. Um, that's just the way it is. Now we'll get them C-clamps, Douglas. We'll put them on here. Please and thank you, buddy. Let's make it tight. I'm going to start from the center. Ah, what's wrong with this one? Booby trap. Maybe, maybe just because I'm working it. Maybe. If you're <laughs> if you're gonna squeeze it on there, Doug, just make sure that you're on the square stop. I don't want no bruises if possible. No bruises on the apples. I used to pick apples a lot. I used to enjoy it. Picking apples? Yep. I have different feelings. Got a little piece of metal there I gotta get rid of. That's going to work out nicely. I think we'll wheel it over and we'll do it as we as we go. We're good. It's not too bad on there. You notice that, Doug? We got that out. Yeah. Um, good. Cut. Is it cut? See a little piece of metal right right there holding me out right there. I had it tacked down more places than I thought than I remembered, eh? You do. You do. Well, we didn't cause no damage, Doug. No, Everything surprise, well surprise. surprise. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Not bad at all. I need a helmet. Where'd that bad boy go? You probably threw it somewhere. I probably did. Probably I love that helmet. Side. Got one there. I don't know what. They all look the same. Man, there's so many helmets around here. Like, I don't know if that's the right yeah, helmet. Yeah, so they all look the same. I don't know which one's which, which one you like, which one you don't. Huh? But, you know, when they fall down, they can all go out the door. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> See that, did you? The helmet? <coughs> ah, when you... You're out of gas, right? Yes. Did you want to pause that while I get gas or you want to film it? Pause! Dinner! Not really. We've got gas. Not real gas. You are gas. You are a bit gassy. <laughs> I've been told. Yeah. By a few. quick here. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, man. Doug, what's up? Will you take that tank and put it on that side? You take that tank, and put it on that side. Okay. Sure. Just because I don't know which ones I do, but. That's it.
how it happens. <laughs> Cut this off. Just gonna weld up a few places here. Worked out pretty good. A little bit rough sometimes, ain't he? Huh? Don't break my disc. <laughs> <laughs> Don't break my disc. Something we all do. Yeah, that's true. Now, when I weld this hood, I guess it's a hood or the door opening for the engine, I would weld this one all up this way. Like just, just exactly how it is. Same with the other side. I turn it on the up scale. I've got a few pieces I want to weld down here before I close it. Getting some air for some reason. that again. Flush it off. I see you out there.
Now. <coughs> Turn this off for a second. What are we at? 57. All right, you've seen how I cut the top of this off and, and tacked that on there? Now I'm going to have to do every edge the exact same way. I've got a little bit of overhang on this side. I do not have enough on this side, and I think the top is perfect. Um, so it doesn't matter what side I go to, But they all have to be tacked down, what I got going on here, and then I can start to weld it up. I am not going to, what? Um, I'm probably going <laughs> to, I'm going to have to take and put some pieces on here to stop the hood from falling in when we go to do that, because there's no way to get our hands in there. Uh, it takes me back to the to the cider truck. <coughs> Colton was digging on one side and I was digging on the other side and nobody was gonna win because you couldn't get your fingers in, you know what I mean? Yeah. You, yeah. Nobody's gonna win. All you're gonna do is get ugly. <laughs> <laughs> if you wanna help me flip this up, Douglas, we'll flip up on, on its side. We'll, we'll put your side down. Let's actually go over there in front where, the, where we took it off. Watch yourself, watch yourself. You. We'll oh. turn up, let your side down. Let just let yours whole side down. Thank you. So now what we're going to have to do is we're going to come in here with the sander wheel. We're going to sand a little bit, tack it on. Sand a little bit, tack it on. Sand a little bit, and that way there we'll get it like this. We want That's what we want it like. We want it like this down here, you know, to, to weld that on and make it look nice. So this is all going to have to be sanded and then weld it. And we'll put our pliers on it so it doesn't go anywhere. And that sort of stuff. On the other side, we were shy. And up the front, we are perfect. This is already up the top. We are perfect. There's nothing overhang there. This is the side that we got to do the work. The other side, we got to do more welding. In the end, I'm hoping it'll be just fine. I'm hoping. And also, I was, me and Doug were talking about the door. If the door does not fit perfectly this way and that way on top of that, when the truck gets filled out, the fill will go on the, on the side that needs it, but you would never be able to tell if it had any fill on it because you've got this square stock going here. You would never gauge the distance, how thick that is, to know if we put the fill on the door or if we put the fill on the truck, basically, is what I'm trying to say. All right, everybody, thanks a lot for coming back and watching us struggle. I didn't <laughs> think it was going to be a struggle like that, but um, sometimes it is. And uh, I just proven it to you. Have a great day, everybody. Come back tomorrow. I'll be here. <laughs>